Reds and Brewers open a four-game series tonight at Great American Ballpark. Great American Ballpark was not unlike the rest of the world. It was goofy-looking glasses and looking up. You know, I'm looking at it now. It's it's basically fully covered, and uh, it's the weirdest thing I've ever been a part of, honestly. It's just dark outside, and it's, what, 3 o'clock during the day, so, yeah, yeah it's a pretty cool experience, though. Well, Graham Ashcraft will try to build upon what he showed against the fight. His slider was exceptional against those Phillies. Oliver Dunn off to a great start for the Brewers, a 300-plus batting average. And he strikes out Dunn. A couple of times up and away. That time, be able to get down and work downhill on that one. Contreras is 5 out of 8 with a homer and a walk. Lifetime against Ashcraft. Chopper grazed Ashcraft's glove, skips to Espinal. Flip to first. It's been Milwaukee who's had Cincinnati's number several years running. Christian Yelich back in the lineup. Pat Murphy saying before the game yesterday he's been dealing with a, a squeaky neck. Jam job, weak roller. Ashcraft pounds the Brewers. A 1 2 3 opening inning. 25 year old Aaron Ashby, who is back on the mound for the Brewers for the first time since the 2022 season. Somebody who the Brewers front office believed in, signing him to that five year contract extension. But he's making his first major league start in 555 days. Stuart Fairchild leads off for just the second time in the big leagues. Good sign, he's up to 93. Ground ball to short. Adamas has it. Hurries the throw just a bit to get Fairchild. One up and one down. Good comeback from Aaron Ashby. Down 2-0 to the count. Steer, the batter of the week. He is top three in the National League in average on a base and slugging. 1-2. Chopped again to short. Adamas. That's off the glove of Hoskins. Steer went through the bag. It'll be an error on Hoskins missing the catch. And the, the umpires are going to conference. In the camera wells, it sits back about six inches to one foot, which puts it out of play. And he's awarded second base. So Nora just pointed to second. To third base. Easy play for Ortiz. He throws him out. Jamer Candelario. Towards right, Churio. The final out of the inning. Ashby clean in the first despite an error. 0 2 on Reese Hoskins facing Ashcraft for the first time. And Ashcraft strikes him out on three. A little giddy up on that fastball. Could not catch up to it. Jackson Churio, the sign with the Brewers for 1.8 million from Venezuela. And Ashcraft hits 100 as he strikes him out. Churio looks back at Ashcraft as if to say, what in the world just happened? And it brings up Ellie De La Cruz, who's been on base in 14 consecutive games. Top to third. Swipe glove gets by Hoskins. De La Cruz turns, falls near the tarp. De La Cruz eyeball slams on the brakes at second. This marks a second straight inning. They've been gifted a man at second base on an error. Santiago Espinal. Runner goes, good jump, pitch tailed away, throw down, safe. That's just the second steal that Milwaukee's allowed on the young year. He stole three in a game once, July 8th in Milwaukee. Grounded, pick. Flick, De La Cruz scores. Reds get a run, they lead one zip. Benson gets the start today against a southpaw. He is one for seven against lefties this year. Benson drills it to right! His first left on left homer in the show. And it's two zip. I tell you, Will Benson is just a different ball player now. Being able to pull the ball to right field, hit the ball to left field, his setup. He showed such progress in spring. David Bell said, you're going to have your shot. Boy, Graham Ashcraft has had it working so far. He struck out three. The only hit he allowed was Sal Freelix infield single to the second baseman, Santiago Espinal. Check swing, appeal, he went. That's four strikeouts. Really good stuff from Graham Ashcraft. You can see the depth on that breaking ball. He's been aggressive tonight. Yeah, I like this version right here. Like he is pitching up with the mission something in mind he's been dominant so far this ball is skied in the air short right field out goes the first baseman second baseman and right fielder all converge but it's Encarnacion strand from first to make the catch and in the inning now the Reds have toiled with men in scoring position so you make a good point giving up an out is a big deal they have not laid down a scored successful sacrifice this year corners pinch a bit there's the bunt third base on the backhand, tough angle throw, gets away! Stevenson breaks from third, he scores! De La Cruz, green light! Throw goes to the plate, and first line, he's safe! Whip down to third, save! Put the ball in play and make him pay! It is 4-0 Reds! Reese 
Hoskins at first base again has trouble handling that throw from third. And then the speed of Ellie De La Cruz scoring from first base. Infield in, man at third, nobody out. Left on left, Benson, hard ground ball, fair, base hit. Espinal scores. Benson turns, he shoots for second. Curios throw, late, ribbing double. Five zip. Will Benson yet again coming up big against his left handed pitching. It feels like the Reds have Ashby on the ropes with Steer standing in and two on. Benson goes, double steal is on. Pitch call to strike, throw to second, not in time. Double steal for the Reds, who ran rough shot of Milwaukee last year. Steer, rocket to left center. Benson scores, Fairchild scores. Steer up to second base. A standing two-run double. It's a five spot of the fourth. Reds by a touchdown. The ninth red of the inning to come to the plate. Jamber Candelario is Ashby's last man this inning. Opposite way, oh, Hoskins. There's the sixth run of the inning. He went down to a knee to try to field it, and it still ate him up and got by him. And that would be the fourth of the game on the Brewers. And that, in fact, is it for Aaron Ashby. Freelick has to stay put at second. And now two outs for Bryce Terang. Terang out to right center. Does it have enough to get out of here? Onto the warning track, and it is gone. A home run for Bryce Terang, his first of the season. It's a pitch up and in, and just pulverized it into right center. Three straight hits by the Brewers. And now you got William Contreras coming up. And listen, this is a ballpark that has seen a ton of home runs, a ton of runs being scored. There's a base hit through the right side. There's Send Ortiz around third. The throw is going to be cut off. It's eight to three. And the Reds lead. It's now eight to three. Nelly De La Cruz flips around left-handed. Payoff is crushed. Deep center. Off the top of the batter's eye. De La Cruz destruction. And a 9-3 Reds edge. Well, that was 112.3 off the bat. It was set to travel an estimated 450 feet. Willie Adamas, he has fly to center, popped to first. This ball is hit well to right. It is deep. Back goes Fairchild at the wall. He leaps. He caught, caught it. you got to be kidding me. Stuart Fairchild robs Willie Adamas of a home run. So two hits in the inning for the crew. Now looking for that big swing and Bryce Terang who provided one back in the fifth comes to the plate for the third time against Ashcraft. That one served down the left field line. Long run for Steer and he can't make the play. It's into the left field corner. Two runs will score on an RBI double to play two by Bryce Terang. Four runs batted in for Terang tonight. Lead off double to the opposite field by William Contreras. Trailing by three runs. Here comes Yelich with nobody out in the seventh. Now Yelich left field steer gone. Christian Yelich goes the other way for a two run bomb and the Brewers are within one. Home run number four for Yelich and he goes the other way against the lefty. The De La Cruz a big league home run his last time up. First pitch center field Freelich was deep coming on. He slides it gets by. De La Cruz can fly. He storms to second. And inside the park, home run for Ellie De La Cruz. I don't know if it gets any more exciting than watching this man run. My goodness. Oh, Lord and Lord, it'll be that fast. The fun this young man has playing yeah. baseball. Think about what we've seen in this game. We go to the top of the ninth inning. Alexis Diaz, the Reds' closer, is on. First and third, two outs. Reese Hoskins is up. One for four. Lifted to right. Fairchild's got it. The Reds never know a deficit. They best the Brewers in their first clash of 2024. They hand the Brewers their first road loss of the year. Ellie De La Cruz right at the heart of it. A big game for the big man. A 10-8 final.